everyone, today I've got a quick Google Docs tutorial for you. I'm gonna be showing you how to add a watermark to your documents here in Google Docs. Maybe you want an image in the background or you want some text that says do not copy. We'll show you how to do both of those today. It's really quite simple to do. So we've got our document open here. The first thing we need to do, head up to the very top left-hand corner. You'll see it says insert. You can go ahead and left click on that and hover down to the option that says watermark. You can go ahead and select that. And this will open up a little window here on the right hand side. Now you can see there's two options. There's image as well as text. Why don't we start out with text? So under text, you can insert your text right here. You can type in whatever you like. So I'll type in do not copy. You can see that put that in the background there. So that's nice and handy. You can also select the formatting. Maybe you want a different font. You can select that. You can adjust the transparency as well as if you want it behind the text or in front of the text, like that. There's also a bold option, italic, as well as a color option here. So if we select this, we can make it nice and bright with a color if we want. We can adjust it just how we need it. If you don't want it any longer, there is a remove watermark option here at the bottom. So let's move on to images. So we've got the text down, let's do an image. So for an image watermark right here, it says select image. So we can click in this area. It will allow us to upload a photo. We can go to our webcam for a photo. There's links, there's photos, Google Drive or Google Images. So there's lots of different ways to get photos. If we want to upload a photo, so make sure upload is selected. We can click here to browse our computer or we can drag and drop. So I'll just drag and drop this image here of the Grand Canyon in. It's gonna upload it and put it in the background of our document. Now here we can adjust the scale. So if we want it to be the full background, you can go all the way up to 500% and you can see I put it in the background there. There's a faded option. So if you turn that off, you can see the full image. We'll leave that on faded. Plus there's more image options right here. You can select that and you can go through things like size and rotation, text wrapping, position, recolor, adjustments, etc. So I'll let you play with that all on your own. Once you're done, just go ahead and hit done and you are all set. Really, it's that simple to add a watermark, whether it's a photo or text here in Google Docs.